In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the unboxing and quick setup of your brother DS640 scanner. So let's start with the unboxing. Scanner comes with the USB connection cable. So we can take it out as we need it. You also get the user manual. So it gives all the information about it. And here is our scanner. It has start and stop button, USB connection port. That's it. So let's start the setup. So I'm going to use a MacBook. So connect this end here. And the other end goes to your MacBook. The green light is stable. Now go to your MacBook and open the Brother website. In this you have to look for the support and service. And then click on the download drivers and guides. Click on the downloads. Type in your brother scanner model DS640. Click search. It will display the name of your scanner. So it selects it MacBook. Select the version of your Mac and then click OK. Here we get the drivers and the utilities. So you have to download the scanner driver that is here. And you also have to download the brother iPrint and scan application. You can download the brother iPrint and scan application from the App Store. And here we have the scanner driver. So let's start with the scanner driver. Agree and download. Open the file. Start the installation process. Click continue. Agree with the terms and conditions. So we have installed it move it to win now go back and download the brother iprint and scan app go to the app store and type in brother iprint and scan and download this app open it in the app we have to add the scanner so at the bottom right hand side you will see select your machine And we can see DS640. Click OK. Click OK. So it says thanks from the brother. So you can just close this window if you want. And go to your app. Now I'm going to show you how to do the scanning. So we have completed the setup. And we will start the scan process. Now adjust the size. Now you can place it here, for example I am going to scan this. Go to the app section and click on the scan button. You can adjust the changes if you want and then you can click on the scan. Instantly it does the scan and it transfers there. So this way we can do the scanning. So this is not a wireless scanner so you always have to plug in the USB cable and then you can use it. So this way we can do the unboxing and complete setup of the scanner using a Macbook. Thanks for watching.